Hey guys, this is Aaron from Park Store and welcome back. Today we are going to talk about this hood in the box, but before we do that, we're going to look at the original hood right there. This is the Ultima Works BMF Lite. Um, as you may have already known, it's already on our product list. We have been selling it. It's going like hotcakes, but I've never taken a video of it because I forgot. I'm sorry. <laughs> right over there, we have the original Ultima Works BMF hood which we will look at. This is a beautiful, beautiful hilt. Super shiny, fingerprint magnet. Um, but you know, literally one of the best things on display. It just glows, it shines, and it's like, you know, like a legacy hilt that you have to have. So this runs on a uh, pre-kit pre format. So you will be able to use the Acera and Profi hearts on this hilt. And that is amazing. So, um, on top of that, okay, let's talk about the hill that we are going to review today. This is the BMF light. So it will come in a packaging like this, super, super long box. I'm just gonna pull it all the way out. And then we have, uh, you will have a 36 times one inch pixel blade in there. Today, I'll be using a demo blade like this. So yeah, you will have a full length blade and the price is incredible. Um, we used to sell the flat hilts at 199, but I think with the recent discounts, it's been brought down to 139, 149-ish. You know, incredible deal. Like you get a, 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 a super nice hilt with a pixel blade. It will have the, um, it will have the small swing. Um, I'll bet a little bit different. And then you will have a pixel blade. And this is the soundboard brief guide. Um, it will come with it, so read through it. Basically tells you, um, you know, how to operate the saber, basic operations, um, what functions it has. It is pretty lengthy, but just look at the bow haters if you need more info. So you can replace the fonts on it um, on this on this version of the hilt. And then you can let me see. Yeah, basically that's it. So um always ensure that the battery is inserted correctly before you charge it. If you charge it with the battery inverted, um, there is a fuse in the hood that will light up and blow itself, but then otherwise you are pretty safe with that. And when that happens, you have to send it back for us to replace it. So this is the hilt. Ta-da! Let's open it up. Okay, let's get the packaging out of the way. Right. Just slide it right here. And there we go. Um, 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 um. Let's open this up. And out comes our beautiful BMF light. Oh, look at that. Another fingerprint magnet! <laughs> so side by side, what do you think? You know, just you know, upfront, being upfront, some people have already told told me that they personally like this hilt more than that the other one because of the crips. This ones are super comfy. Oh and there is some heft to it. It is pretty weighty. Oh, but this is so much heavier. Oh, this thing weighs a ton. But this one, ooh, nice weight. It's not like our, um, you know, Mavericks, which are super light series. Feels good. Okay, so up close off the hilt, we have the vented emitter. We have. Oh, my fingerprints are showing already. We have the power button right here. There is a little thing that you can remove there. And then you charge it via USB-C. 
I know, can't believe how much time has passed ever since we brought USB-C to the boards many years ago and nowadays it's a standard and then we have this grips right here and if you look on a close up of the grips you can see there is a texture on the grips and then right here we have some of that same texture right at the bottom with a vented pommel for sound retention screw right here and you can let me see i think you can open it up right in the middle to review the flight board and also the battery which is removable so it's nice to take it out uh, when not in use charge it monthly and then we have the speaker right there so slide it back in ooh, 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 squeaky squeaky ah there you go Okay, so I'm just gonna insert the blade right now. Always ensure that the saber is off. When you're inserting the blade, apply pressure to the blade so that it's uh, being pushed inwards before you tighten the retention screw. You feel a little resistance on the blade so that feels good and then tighten it. Once you feel resistance, just go a little bit more and you're fine. So there we go, let's uh, press and hold to power it on. Let me just turn it this way. Press and hold, power it on. Apprentice. And change colors by... The, um, so it's a one button function. So tap the button, and then twist the hold. Oops. Oh, there we go. Oh, perfect color. That's what I'm looking for. So, look at that. Very nice. Yeah, don't you think so? I think this looks really good. And you know, for those ones who have been always asking me, can you use the BMF to fight with? Can you duo with it? Just get this. Get this, you know? Even if you buy them both, it's not going to cost much. The sound on this is definitely um, on the softer side. Let me see if I can tune it. Uh, so double tap the power button. That's mute. Level 1. Level 2. Level 3, I think. Level 4. This is the loudest it goes. But yeah, still pretty cool. Pretty nice. Let's lock up. There you go. This is the Ultima Works BMF light. Very, very nice saber. So press and hold, power it off. Power off. And there you go. 129 bucks or 149, sorry. Um, whichever. You know, super deal, grab it, grab it as a gift, grab it to go for dueling. Very nice. If you like what we do, follow our Facebook page, The Puck Store, and our YouTube channel, Reviewers Magic, for more of these awesome stuff. Thanks for watching, guys, and have a good one. Cheers.